those that's the leader storm okay Aurora Black Panther's wife I had to get that Marvel select I was actually in uh, Orlando when I picked up that Falcon I thought this Falcon was so cool because of the way they designed it and the way it looks do you see him he's actually in his uniform and they got the wings I like that that combat look that's why I got that and you won't be seeing that just anywhere either <laughs> okay then you got your Luke Cage you got my favorite character, my blade, the actual Wesley Snipes blade with the comic book. That's Goliath, okay? And if you notice, it looks old. That's because that's one of the first Marvel Legends that they did. That is my most expensive uh, legend. And I had to look for it forever. I found it at the show, the same show. Uh, Megacon that I did. Okay. Now, guys, let's go down. War Machine. Okay. But this is something that my wife did for me, too. Do you see the uh, display? She knows that Apocalypse was one of my favorite and it was one of the hardest characters to find. Okay. Right next to Apocalypse had to have this bishop no hair bald okay you're not gonna find that just anywhere so i got my apocalypse my bishop war machine if we go down deathlock okay another the original version of falcon but this is a character most of you guys don't know. This is a cop that turns into vengeance. That is actually a version of Ghost Rider. So you got Johnny Blaze. Um, you got Stacy Keach, which I think is his uh, stepbrother. And you got Vengeance. Okay. Now. We're going over here. Okay, the show that's getting ready to come out, Falcon and the Winter Soldier. That is actually that Captain America Falcon uniform that he should be wearing. Okay, right next to him is Kate Bishop. Okay, she's uh, another version of Hawkeye. And you got Marvel's Vision. Right next to it, you got War Machine. Then you got... War Machine from Avengers Endgame. And then you got Iron Patriot with the Thor in there, okay? I had to have Iron Patriot because I thought Rhodey was like the coolest character even before I saw him in film. This is Sync right here and he's a member of Generation X which is another um, X-Men team. Then you got Rage, who came from the uh, New Warriors. And you got one of my favorite new characters, Night Thrasher, which came from the New Warriors. Carl Mordo in the comic book is, how should I say it? He's an older white wizard, but they changed him up for the movie, okay? And they made him black. Now, Brother Voodoo is another old, old character. And I thought it was cool that they brought him back because you would only see him in like the early 70s, okay? These two characters here, uh, Cottonmouth and Rock Python are from the Serpent Society, which means that they fight Captain America. This is General Bridges uh, from Cable. You guys know Nick Fury, Miss Hill, and Agent Coulson from S.H.I.E.L.D., okay? Next, from Old Man Hawkeye, you learn that this Spider-Woman 
is actually his daughter. And as you guys can see, that's my ultimate Miles Morales. That's my Into the Spider-Verse Miles Morales. That's my Into the Spider-Verse Prowler. That's the actual original Prowler from the Spider-Man comic books. And everybody knows Cloak and Dagger because they just had a show. But that's actually Cloak. Next to him is Tombstone. And next to Tombstone is actually his daughter, which is, uh, what do we call her? I'm sorry, I can't think of her name right now. But that's his actual daughter. I'll think of his, her name soon. That's the Spider-Man 2 Electro, which Jamie Foxx played. That's the up-to-date version of Deathstroke. And you guys all know him, doll, from Thor. If you come down, Thunderball from the Wrecking Crew. And that's the new version of Domino, which is the uh, uh, black chick with the hair, which I liked. This right here, the reason I keep her there, that's Sink. That's Bishop's sister, okay? So if you guys didn't know, Bishop has a sister. Sunspot from New Mutants, and that's Bishop, right? Next to Bishop is Sunfire, okay? From the X-Men, then there's another version of Storm. Now, this is my favorite version of Storm because this is Storm with the mohawk, which I thought was just totally cool, okay? Come down, you got your Black Panther, the glowing version. Next to him, you have Nakia. Next to her, you have an actual Dora Maja, which are the female warriors. And next to her, we have Shuri, okay? Which is the Black Panther's sister. Now, most people don't, uh, know that Claw didn't look like Claw in the movie. They made him, they sort of cast him down. This is what Ulysses Claw is supposed to look like, okay? And right next to him is Shuri in her actual Black Panther outfit. Now, they haven't recast who the new Black Panther is and they keep saying it's Shuri. Okay, if it's Shuri, that's what she's going to look like. That is what she is supposed to look like when she becomes the new Black Panther and different from the old Black Panther who was just taught to fight and he really didn't get deep into mysticism. Shuri is going to be deep into mysticism and she's going to be a warrior. Right next to her is my Civil War's Black Panther. Next to him is my Killmonger in costume next to him is the other Eric Killmonger when he was looking for Black Panther. Okay, next to him is T'Chaka. That is Black Panther's dad. That is not T'Challa. T'Challa is the Black Panther, but his father is T'Chaka. That is my original version, the hardest version of the Black Panther to find, okay? Then we start to get down into Patriot, which you guys, if you don't know, his father is the original. Steve Rogers was not the first Captain America, y'all, okay? A gentleman by the name, I think, of Isaiah Thomas is the first Captain America. They experimented on him first, okay? Patriot is his son. Okay, Patriot ends up being the sidekick of the Falcon. So the Falcon is the one that's actually training him the way Steve Rogers trained the Falcon. Now, these last two, White Tiger, Misty Knight, Claire Temple, and Luke Cage, Heroes for Hire. That's who they are. Those, three, those four work for the Heroes for Hire, which is also Iron Fist is in there, Daredevil is in there, um, Moon Knight is in there, okay? 
So you have actually seen my entire room. Everybody has been saying that they wanted to see my room. They wanted to see all of the stuff in it. Well, you have seen everything in it so far, okay? I hope you enjoyed the tour. There will be more stuff soon because um, Marvel has a wave coming out of X-Men and a bunch of other things. Oh, guys, I wanted to ask you this. We are doing the uh, Wolverine giveaway, okay? You guys were correct. My favorite character was Nightcrawler. How can you not like the fuzzy elf? I grew up with Wolverine, Colossus, Nightcrawler, Storm, Cyclops, uh, Rogue, Jean. I have not been able to find a Nightcrawler anywhere. So we're going to actually have to substitute it for something. So guys, at the bottom credits, hit me up and tell me what other X-Men would be cool besides Nightcrawler. Because I haven't been able to find Nightcrawler. I haven't been able to find uh, Mr. Sinister. And then Mr. Sinister was really cool. But neither of those. So we're going to get, we're going to actually pick a person this week for the Wolverine. And you guys are going to tell me all the people, as a matter of fact, not you guys, everybody that uh, picked Nightcrawler, hit us back on this YouTube. If you did not pick Nightcrawler, do not respond because you did not win. <laughs> okay, we're going to have to pick one of the people that picked Nightcrawler. Now, um, Nathan is going to be the one to pick the winner for the Wolverine. So we're going to see who actually sent the most subscribers. If you guys didn't say anything, I suggest you start letting us know now who sent the most subscribers because Nathan's going to pick. As a matter of fact, Nathan doesn't like having to go to different places. So everybody respond at the bottom of this video. Tell me how many people you sent here, <laughs> this video, okay? And we also want all the people that responded and told and said it was Nightcrawler to respond at the bottom of this comment and let us know what you think would be a cool X-Men. If I can't locate Nightcrawler, who else would you guys like to have? And another Wolverine is not a problem. Okay, so you guys are like, hey, um, I would think uh, another Wolverine. Remember, House of M has a bad Wolverine getting ready to come out. I'm actually probably going to get one for myself. So everybody, comment at the bottom. Let me know how many people you sent, okay? And the people who actually said Nightcrawler, you were correct. Comment at the bottom so we can pick from one of you guys. But I can't find a Nightcrawler. Okay? Tell me what are the X-Men you think is cool. I hope you enjoyed the tour. Peace.